So, you are here with the Outer Worlds, doing that thing. And what am I doing? I don't know what thing I'm doing. <laughs> here, I'll just spin in circles. There we go. There we go. All right. So basically, I was just cleaning out the map, going where everywhere, and um, trying to get my level up, which I'm almost 25, which was a goal, because that's recommended to the level for uh, the Gorgon expansion or DLC, which we're really close to. But I was looking into it, and I think I have, I might have to have certain missions done in order to start that DLC. So, I'm going to clean out this building real quick, and then I think I'm going to jump back to one of the ports. One with a store, at least. Um, get rid of all my access. Excess. And see if I can access that from there. If I can't, then I'm going to jump through the uh, main story quest or not, uh, mission. Great work. Because completing that will definitely. So. Let it armor. Some mods. Yes, we like mods. It's helmet. Marauder survivalist helmet. That's actually one of my favorite helmets in the game. Favorite looking. One of them. All right, there we go. So, let's do as I says. And, let's jump over to port. Uh, we'll go with this one. We'll go with Paul Brook. Because if not, then I get to make a run up this hill. <laughs> and talk to some people, but we'll check it out. Hello. How's everybody doing today? Huh? Huh? As I said, if this is something I access now, then I'm just going to jump out of Fallbrook real quick and run around killing a few things. And then I'm going to start clean out my, all my inventory. Wink. And, yeah, go from there. Also, I want to throw some mods on the gun here. I think maybe I'll just go regular Magnum on the gun. Since both people I like using has uh, plasma or whatever. You seen energy today? on their bullets. Nah, 
last time I saw him was I think my scope's good. I don't know. We'll see. And I think I actually picked up a fun time barrel for this, so that should do it for this gun. So we'll check out the super scoper, see if I like that better than this. So I think the super scooper is the scooper, super scooper. Scoper is the uh, big magnification. And once I do that, then I believe I have everything I wish to have for this character right now. Which means... I can still start upgrading it. I don't know if I need to save money for Pavati and her dress up thing. But, yeah. Okay, just called my ship over. So we can hop into it. You know, I could ask a question, and if you guys aren't in chat, you guys can leave comments. If and when I post this, post this on uh, YouTube. But the best martial arts or self-defense program, and why, would be the question. So. Discuss amongst yourselves. Okay, so what we're checking is this. And I. Closest plan is mining coming was first established. An outpost here. Okay. And this. Atmosphere is reclaimed. Distillation plants in the atmosphere. Harvest these gases for energy. Compass, Taurus, Typhon. I see planetoid on the edge of the Halcyon. Typhon has nothing to offer the Halcyon. So it's one of these three. One of these, I think. Skrilla, we've been to. Uh, we still have a side mission with uh, old boy to hit on Skrilla. But. Um, do, 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 do. I don't know which one, where to go to activate the Gorgon. Um, so 
Ah, okay. So... Looked it up real quick. So, yeah. Gorgon. You you have to get the Monarch first. Which means that we have to go ahead and finish Radio Free. Weapons. Yep. Ain't no call for a closer inspection by anybody. So, I wanted to want to whisper Funtime Barrel. Look at that. That barrel looks like it belongs on a sniper rifle. And it gives me more critical damage. I'm okay with it. Effective maximum range. Go with that. And as I said, I think I'll go with a magnum on this. There we go. That will be my sniper rifle. Okay. So that means I got to go ahead and get rid of some things real quick here. For the sake of getting a mission done. Cuz I am way overweight. <laughs> I am having problems with so much junk and not enough room for it. Yeah. So. We are going to go ahead and finish Radio Free. We're going to drop doing any side missions. Which is not a normal thing for me because there's still several to get done here. First, I'm going to test out my weapon here. Yeah. Do 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 do. Fall Burk. Wait, aren't we on Monarch? No. Hmm. Anyway. You'd think folks were pissing in the alleyway as bad as it's been. Oh, they are. No rats. This is the downside to being over encumbered. I do kind of move comparatively slow. Otherwise, I usually run everywhere. Everywhere. For a bore. Arl, arl. All right. Talk to this guy. No rubbernecking. Yeah, whatever. Let's make a deal. Oh. So, I need to sell things. I'm going to sell this. going to sell this. And I'm going to sell this. Should I sell this? 
I don't see why not. I'm never going to use that. I'm never going to put it on anybody. So. It's a fun little launcher, though. But in rays, in rays do a very specific damage, you know. So, uh, uh, uh. okay, armor, Marauder, survivalist. So let's, we'll sell this. We'll sell this. Maybe I'll throw these on somebody. Who would I throw it on? Yeah, I'll throw the helmet on somebody. So we'll sell that. Money is good. Because we're going to end up spending a lot of money. Debt. Good to see you, man. It's been a while. It's been a while. And straight up chunk a bunch of this stuff. Uh, energy drink. Those weigh one piece. Screw that noise. I don't want to keep those. I mean, that's 20 pounds right there. Nope. To done. Gone. I'll throw ointment in my medicine thing. I should throw in nicotine in my inhaler. Yeah, just a minute or two. Just a minute or two. They're dead. <laughs> I should throw in cosmic smokes. You know, I'm going to do that. Just for the laugh of it. Sold that energy drink I was saving for no good reason. So be it. it. Suddenly really isn't that important to me. Can I pull some? I might save that one. this improved hunter might throw that on something how much weight yeah one and a half pounds I'm okay with that and junk sell all junk woohoo
All right. So, where do we need to go? What do we need to do for this Radio Free March? Radio Free Monarch, not Monarch. Monarch. Go up to Devil's Peak and speak with the information broker. Okay. Well, if we're going to do that, we are going to cut out some of the travel on that. We're going to do that by jumping over here. And then we're going to go this direction. Until we run into something. Matter of fact, I think there's a cave way or a back way in through here. If I remember correctly. Great thing about this, we can go and find out. Yeah. Yeah. Drain of time. Oh, 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 yeah. I have to make sure I throw my... Throw my <clears throat> cigarettes in my medicine nailer. Yeah, because that's ridiculous of an idea. This. Oh, I need to repair equipment here. Yes. Um. There we go. We'll just eat that. There we go. We'll throw that in. That way. Multicolored cigarettes. With my healthy stuff. Because that's just ridiculous. And there's just some ridiculous things you can improve of in this world. Other ridiculous things you just do. Because they're ridiculous. And that's the philosophical moment of the stream. Easy does it. You know, it's a mana queen. Here we go. Shot it in his paw. In his paw. You guys gonna finish it? You guys gonna let it chase me down? You guys can use this. Here, somebody shotgun that guy. Anyway. Boom. Boom. Uh, uh, so, right? Get, what you been up to, my man? What kind of crazy, crazy, insane things have encompassed your world of late? have a crazy insane job that crazy insane things happen at all the time okay um can we get this now no we cannot There is a Really? You're coming back? I mean Yeah, isn't it? That boy done grew up Everybody done growing up. Here we go. 
Here, shotgun. Okay. Are you basically going to be doing the same thing, though? Their debt? Resident Marauder Thug. Dropkick the big insect. Stand up, run, run away. Shuck him. I'll take your confession now. Yes. <laughs> Shotgun those giant silkworm thing. There we go. All dead. Thing about the thing that you do is you do it well and you've been doing it in a long time, right? So, new contractor, no, might as well be doing it. Right? Just a couple years. Nothing. You've been, you've been doing it for just a minute or two. Hey, you! Get over here! They're marauders. Who's talking there. to me? Where? Okay. So, there's some side things I can go ahead and do down here. Oh, yeah. More monies. More money. Good call. Um, do, 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 do. I'm debating whether I should. Yeah. Should. Get this done. Oh. This is kind of a side mission to do before you go up there. And I should get it done. <sighs> okay. So, basically these guys are missing their boss. And you can go down and rescue their boss. Which is that person that was yelling at us at the top of the hill. It's her boss too. So might as well. Hello, mustache guy. Mr. Donald. How'd you get up here? Through the caves? No. What caves? Good answer. I wasn't looking forward to gut-shotting you. See, the thing yeah, is, I'm anyway. with the corporate compliance crew. 
C3, if you will. <laughs> We're mercs. And our current contract mandates that we annihilate any creatures or persons that emerge from the tunnel. Allow me to intervene. It's my job to mediate any conflicts of interest regarding C3 and third parties. Well, good for you. All right. First things first. To make a decision in this dispute, I'm going to need to know what your role in your organization is. I'm the boss. I'm the C... <laughs> Wolfpack of one. A lean but efficient corporate structure. I'm impressed. Still, <laughs> I gotta wonder. What are your intentions regarding Devil's Peak Station? That is why you've wandered out here, I presume. I didn't wander. Came here on purpose. Don't know what you're talking about. Might I remind you that it is unethical to lie in an arbitration? Our guidelines allow us some leeway in identifying threats to our client. Your unorthodox profession makes me think we ought to remove you from the premises permanently. Nope. However, the terms of our contract specifically targets marauders, iconoclasts, MSI operatives, and anyone deemed to hobo-like <laughs> in appearance. <laughs> I'm not sure he has a daughter. He's still in mediation after 10 years. <laughs> They're still hammering out that contract without him hammering out anything. Um... So, um, okay, and as you don't appear to fit any of those categories, right. I'm afraid I can't quite make a call on you. Not quite. Do we as a standing policy provide an alternative to termination via financial restitution? Nope. Addy, our chief financial officer, could confirm, but I'm betting if you're willing to compensate us for our lost time and productivity due to this arbitration, you could pass. Eh, can't we all just get along? I guess we might could. <laughs> yeah, Something of course like we might could. You. Can't put my finger on it, but I feel like I'd rather have you with us than against us. All right. Lance, unless you have a final point of contention to make, I'd say he's clear to go. Nah, I'll sign the clearance form. Just, I must advise you to steer clear of Devil's Peak Station. It's teeming with marauders. Anything else you need? Nope. Oh, by the way, how did it get overrun if you were hired to guard it? Good question. Trying to say we didn't do our job? I'll have you know our contract was to stop any marauders coming from the caves. Didn't say nothing about the ones taking the mountain path. Cool. We'll simply clear them out later, once we've got the go-ahead from Berthold. Okay. Berthold, you're your boss? That's right. Berthold Fox is our boss man. Founder, president, and CEO. Bertie went down into the caves on a hunt for marauders, give or take, six hours ago. No? He's a hands-on type. Likes to handle the tougher tasks himself. Although, he should have been back. Going on six hours now. I'd ask you to check the caves for him, but then we'd have to kill you when you crawl back out. Well, if you make me honorary C3, I can go and look for him. Yeah. Done. Use this. Signal's locked to Birdie's tracker. Should lead you right to him. Or his body. Whatever you find. Bring him back to us, okay? All right. By the way, who's your client? The guy calls himself the information broker. Like he's starring one of those fancy broadcast productions the station wiki, wiki. puts out. That's the guy we're looking is... for. He brokers information. Don, <laughs> I know. I don't care if the guy's name is the architect himself, so long as we get paid well and paid on time. Cool. No dispute here. All right, I'll be going. So, sidetracked. We're gonna go ahead and run down in those caves now, and go ahead and get Birdie. 
I believe there's something chilling up here though. Oh, wait, Marauders. Hey, Marauders. You shooting at us? Look at you. Well done. We are victorious. Um. Maybe I didn't want to go that way. I need to hang a left, right? Yeah. Just hang a left. And hope that we don't end up in a dark corner in our room. Mechanical. Mechanical goes. some bits. I'm really getting lazy about looting people. <laughs> this lazily to the left. Yeah. Oh, where are these caves? I forgot where the caves are. I'm supposed to be heading toward. over here but I've opened up these fast travels so that's good I missed the caves on the way up I feel like I missed them on the way up so first suggestion of debt we are gonna list lazily forward and to the left we'll list lazily to the left and we'll tilt forward how's that we'll call this cave our windmill and we'll, we'll tilt toward it oh there we go cave Little cave. Before we go in there, I think I'll get a save in real quick.